don't get distracted. <clears throat> don't get distracted. Don't get distracted. All right? My command this morning, Mary's daily bread. Okay. And we'll, of course, use one night with the king. When I upload any video, it's pretty simple. I'm watching something or I'm led to something. Our Heavenly Father bed says, all right, record from this spot. Now stop, upload. <clears throat> so we're gonna use that. <laughs> and then everybody's familiar with Haman representing the enemy. Pretty similar when my wife comes here. Peter, Satan is trying to sift you, but I'm praying for you. And then we look at what happened afterwards. Even though Peter gets the warning, a woman says, weren't you with the Galilean? Now you see that in scripture. But I know for a fact what went through Peter's defenses, because of course he had the armor of God. He saw everything. He saw the miracle, ear healed. I did actually do that in this life too, but <clears throat> in the choir, I, this guy couldn't hear. All right. Why is he in the choir if he can't hear, Lord? He couldn't hear fully. It's a long story. So what goes through his thought, the thought that is projected into him, projected into him, projected into him, Where in the scripture does it say the Messiah is supposed to be arrested? Well, if you know scripture, they pierced me. How does that occur without being arrested? So many of you, <clears throat> As we dig, you have to see <clears throat> with the eyes to see and the ears to hear what was going on in your kingdom marriage. Now the kingdom marriage is a movement from my heavenly father through me who is my Heavenly Father. And it's real. It is evidence of God's love on this earth right now. And you have the opportunity of being a part of that. You have your own spouse. So that's what pretty much always happens <clears throat> between me and Cherie Mary. Mary, Mary, Mary now. Every single time. <clears throat> so I'm trying to show her the difference. Well, this is me in ministry mode. And what I used to do in the streets If I saw one of mine and I was waiting for one of mine, I found one of mine and they were wrapped up in meth or heroin or something like that. Lead them into my house, get them drinking for three days to get off the withdrawals. And then in that time, be ministering to them, planting the seeds. <clears throat> 
So I do the same thing with her. Let me get you distracted from the devil. Let me lead you back to your marriage. And what usually happens is out of distrust, dirasa. My wife will sit there talking to a demon. I'm not supposed to be here, am I? Demon just looks, dear. You really think that's Jesus? I knew it, I knew it. <laughs> As if the devil wants her near Jesus. So our Heavenly Father says, dig a bit more. If you are inviting the opinion you want to hear, you have to look at yourself. What is it about this opinion I want to hear over God's truth? <clears throat> disaster will come upon disaster and rumor will be heaped on rumor. They will seek a vision from a prophet but the law and guidance will be lost from the priest and wise counsel will cease from the elders. The king of Judah will mourn and the prince Zedekiah will be clothed with garments of despair and anguish and the hands of the people of the land shall tremble in terror. I will deal with them in accordance with their conduct and by their judgments I will judge them and they will know without any doubt that I am the Lord. So I know Babylonian captivity. I know there were converts. I know what really happened in that story. I know the difference between Hebrew and Jewish. <clears throat> Part of our union is I am Hebrew and so is my wife. She's also Jewish. <clears throat> when we pick apart the fact that many people practice their Christianity their way, I'm not following Jesus, I'm not walking with Jesus, but I'm still a Christian doing Christian things. Now, anybody <clears throat> who's been a Christian for a while has been around a Christian and you've seen the change. What change are you talking about, Lord? They were on fire for me, nothing but worship music, reading their Bible, and then not so much time in the Bible anymore. This turned to secular music. I'm not going to church this Sunday. Now my wife goes up to these demons <clears throat> and looks at me, I knew it, you're evil. And I'm sitting there, none of these people pick up their cross. They're not carrying their cross. They're not hearing from me. I'm standing right in front of you, dear. 
<clears throat> I just talked to my Heavenly Father two seconds ago. That's why I'm standing here. I was giving my wife her time outside. Holy Spirit said, go outside. I go outside. There's my wife talking to this dude. He's holding my dog. He says, I just bought brand new toys. Puppy toys. Puppy toys. Puppy. My wife's eyes light up. That is so beautiful. I'm like, this is going to stop. Because I can see what's happening. I think any husband would see what's happening. <clears throat> I ministered to him, brought him in here. What do you think? Well, it's so small. God is with me, not you. Teaching you to tell the difference, but... <clears throat> So when we look at the story of Esther, because <clears throat> what I try and do is take everybody's life and say, this is how I see you. This is how I see the situation in the spirit. How it looks from the outside <clears throat> is very, very different than how it looks in the spirit, unless you have the eyes to see and the ears to hear. <clears throat> As we dig, and I think about all the occurrences like this that have happened, in her mind, if she didn't think she was married, then from the outside, in other words, plain speech, without the revelation, without the revelation, without the revelation, it looks normal. That is a normal thing. If I thought someone was just my friend, <clears throat> then I would talk to whoever I wanted to. in a ministry capacity, I would, because I'd still be, well, <clears throat> praying to find my wife. So, <clears throat> in your kingdom marriages, you have to respect marriage, the institution of it, and how sacred God takes it. So people are telling her, don't go inside there. That's the lion's den. So we take that as what the devil meant for evil, God used for good. Keep your marriages between you two and don't let other people in to your life if I send them I will alert you before that you can read it in scripture I will tell you all of this stemmed from Something my Heavenly Father told me. Your marriage is not going to work in Portland. But we also knew the... Familiar spirit. The Holy Spirit had me write that on the whiteboard. Familiar spirit. So I spent a lot of time with the familiar spirit because it was in my wife. I lived with the familiar spirit. <clears throat> the false Holy Spirit.
the indication of the false Holy Spirit. When my wife comes here, I blend with her. I put my spirit in her. <clears throat> and there was this time where she, she was riddled once, like bad, bad riddled. Her face changed. So this is an indication of why she was saying, you're not you. How it can make you view things distorted backwards. You have to really be going slow right now and stay on the narrow path. And that's when she came from the church. So, demon proofing your marriage for that day, you have to be in your bubble where you're receiving your revelation and your truth. To know it's from me is what you have to learn. So you guys got up this morning, you put on the armor of God, you renewed your mind, you confirmed everything in scripture. The guy just confirmed, okay, that is what happened. That is what continually happens. That's all I'm supposed to say. I love you.